here's a cool little game you can do for your boys or girls. I have here just a, an ordinary file um, plastic folder book that I put an old book into to keep it, to preserve it. So what I did is I just took out one of my little boy's favorite pages and over here I took a letter size paper and I cut it in 12 and then well, this is I prepare this before he sees it and I write a little blend or a little sound that we're working on for each one and then I place it on top of that favorite picture to cover it so he doesn't know what picture it is underneath it and so I tell him look look at all these sounds if you can read all these sounds you get to see your picture and so I would prepare this ahead of time so he doesn't see the picture of course okay we have here so he has 12 sounds to review and read so he reads me a sound and he gives me a word for it or you can just have him read the sounds or you can even have these as words or numbers or alphabet, anything that you want to review with your child or you want to give him extra practice on. So we have here our blends. So he had to read the blends and give me a word. And if he did that correctly, for example, shr shrimp, if he did that right, he gets to keep his paper and he gets to see underneath. And so it, it's a lot of fun and it's a good motivation for him to continue reading. Spr spring. Ooh, look at that. More cars, more vehicles. His favorite. Spl splash. Scruff. And on and on you go till you finish your whole page, till your child can see the whole paper. See that he accomplished something. And he has lots of fun as he does it. So maybe you can try this with anything. You can even place them on top of a book if you don't have a little folder book like this that you can take the sheets out. You can just um, place his sounds on top of a picture from a book. Anyway, this is very simple and a good way to practice his reading skills.